Hi, I'm George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland. Let's talk about the future of data center backup. The, the problem with data center data protection today is that getting the environment fully protected has become a, a, a nightmare uh, for a number of reasons. Number one, we've got really important applications out here like Oracle, Exchange, SQL, SharePoint. Uh, the, the databases themselves are growing in size, but not necessarily as fast as uh, some other devices in the environment, but they're growing, more importantly, in importance. Uh, many environments nowadays, if the database application's down, the business is down. So those become very critical. Email, like Exchange, is, is the, the default means of communication in an organization. It's, it's probably more readily utilized now than dial tone is. So it has to stay up and running. Uh, and then SharePoint, uh, same thing, becoming a huge tool for collaboration. So we're seeing more and more use of that. At the same time, we're also seeing uh, a growth in the VMware environment. So uh, a, a significant growth there. And, and that requires a different form of data protection. And then finally, we're also seeing a growth in NAS. Again, not necessarily new, but just the amount of data that's on these systems is incredibly high. So if you look at this, where we're, what we see today in most data protection processes is a, a truly fragmented market. Uh, there might be uh, different, there, there's typically some sort of attempt at an enterprise backup strategy. So there's one product that is uh, trying to back up all these uh, compon components in one fell swoop, uh, maybe to a tape device, but um, increasingly to a disk backup appliance. Uh, and then there's uh, little offshoot programs. The, the Oracle team might have their own favorite uh, data protection product, and, and that might be going to their, its own storage. Uh, same with the Exchange guys, uh, same with the, the SQL guys. Uh, in, in fact, some of these might be doing their own local protection, but using the company NAS as a, as a store. So that also creates a problem. And then certainly in the VMware environment, this is really important, is we're seeing a huge um, market evolve as far as data protection specifically focused on the VMware environment, hoping that you eventually get to 100% uh, virtualized environments. We don't see that happening anytime soon. We think that there will be a lot of these sort of standalone bare metal servers that are serving very important tasks even as the VMware environment continues to grow. So that is another fragment to that market. We're even seeing multiple tools being used there. And then finally in the NAS environment, a lot of times that's picked up by the enterprise application, but there's also sort of uh, specialized applications there as well. So every so often an organization will attempt to sort of uh, consolidate this fragmentation and centralize on one application. And what happens is you end up giving up some capabilities along the way, right? So what we think makes sense going forward is for vendors to start modularizing their applications so the, and, and their hardware so that you can pick the best of breed as it makes sense. I think you want an enterprise application to try to pick up as much of the environment as you can, but then where it makes sense and there's a business need, go ahead and have the ability to put in uh, specific data protection capability, but then somehow have that centrally managed into a single um, interface and even over time a, a single policy manager, scheduler, everything like that. I, that's where we th see the future of backup heading in the environment is the ability to have a blanket protection with, with a traditional enterprise application, but then the ability to have essentially plugins for specific uh, environments uh, that are available in the, in the data center today and new ones we don't even know about. So that's a quick look at the future of data center backup. I'm George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland. Thank you for joining us.